I'm going to do an exercise for Wright Patterson Mahjong using the 2022 Green Book. This exercise is called Charleston Force. We're going to pre select categories from the book and force hands in just these categories. This is a good exercise if you want to push yourself out of your comfort zone and play categories you might normally not consider. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. For the first one, we're going to be player two, south, west is prevailing, and we need to force one of these categories, mixed suits, Chinese teas, or jewel. Since we're south, I'll get 13 tiles, and I'll create a muck Charleston. We have west, east, and a red, two, three, seven, eight in dots, pair two, two, five, eight in bams, three, six in cracks. Pair two, mixed suits, Chinese teas, or jewel. If these were your tiles, which of these would you force? And what would be your first discards? If these were my tiles, I think I would force Chop Suey. Little Chows in each suit with news and one win paired. So we wouldn't need that. We'll keep twos, threes. Hopefully we'll get some ones. So maybe we can pass These three. We're gonna try for chop suey or maybe little chows. We got a three and an east. Let's pass these three. No keepers. Oh wait, we got a north. So we have two, three, two, and three. So we have a couple of duplicates in here. That would work for little chows, but we need ones and a four if we play little chows. We almost have news though. Let's pass these three. We got a south. We have news with one win paired. So we need a one dot. One bam, three bam, one crack, two crack. I guess that was okay for mixed suits. If you would have done something differently, write, pull one in the comment section below and let me know what you would do with these tiles. So now we're gonna be west, so we'll get 13 tiles, and east is prevailing.
we have west, one, two, three, five, nine in dots. Three, five, eight, nine in bams. Two, three, four in cracks. We need to force Chinese teas or jewel. Chinese teas and jewel are one suit with dragons or winds. We do have a wind here and we are west. Maybe we can try a Chinese tea hand. Jasmine, three pungs, two, three, four, six, eight, two, three, west. Pung of white dragons with a pair of west winds. For jewel, two, three, four, six, eight, or one, three, five, seven, nine. Let's see. Let's, let's focus on dots. So for jewel, this would probably work for one, three, five, nine, opal. Four pungs under a chouse and a pair in two, uh, three, four, five, seven, nine. So three, five, nine. No ones. Okay, let's see what happens. So let's just divvy these out. How about those three? Five. No keepers. Here's a south. That's not helpful though, because we need west with white. Let's pass these through. Oh, three. And then eight. Four discards. Two, let's see, three, four, five, nine for a jewel hand. Three, four, five, seven, nine. So we wouldn't be able to use these. And we would need a white dragon for opal. Three, five, oh, we don't need an eight either. Let's see, for Chinese teas, so let's see, we have three, five. That's all we could do for opal. But for Chinese tea, for jasmine, two, four, six, eight, white and west. Pom poms is three, five, seven, nine with white and west. Three, five, nine. I think I would call this for pom pom. 92, number 92 on page 27. We could use three, five, nine and west. All we need in here really is a white dragon. Of course, we need a seven dot in here. But I'd say we're on our way for probably Chinese teas. If you would do something differently, write pull two in the comment section below and what you would do with these tiles. We're gonna be east this time, so we'll get 14 tiles. South is prevailing and we need to create a jewel hand. That's one suit with or without corresponding dragons. We have a pair of Norse, a red dragon, one, six, seven, nine in cracks, one, four, seven, eight in dots, and a two. So we have pair seven, pair eight. For jewel hands, two, three, four, six, eight. Two, three, four, six, eight. We have seven and eight. Two, three, four, six, eight. Four, eight. Or we could do three, four, five, seven, nine. A seven. So let's hold four and eight. And then let's 
break these up and hold the cracks because we have the corresponding dragon. We have six, seven, nine. So we could do, let's see, three, four, five, seven, nine. There's seven, nine. Or we could do two, three, four, six, eight. We have a six. So probably garnet for the jewel hand or four, eight would be pearl if we can get a white dragon. So we really don't need this. No ones. Let's break up the north, the seven, and pass a one. How about, I think it's six, six one half dozen the other. Okay, let's pass these three. We've got a four and a seven. It's two, let's see, three, four, five, seven, nine with dragons for garnet. Three, four, five, seven, nine. There's also gemstones, three pungs and or chows in mixed suits, each dragon two paired. We have a pair here, pair here. Here's a mixed, almost a mixed chow. We can get a three crack and then the dragons. Okay, so let's Let's pass these three. We're looking for cracks. Well, here's a two, two, three, four. No, what is it? Two, three, four, six, eight. Or three, four, five, seven, nine with the dragon. We have four nine there. We need one more tile. We could pass blind, but I wouldn't. Really, we're not getting, I would not pass two fours. Okay, so let's see. One, two, seven, eight, four, two. I think I would let this go. We have one, two. Actually, I think I would hold that for a mixed suit chow. So I think I would let the six go. Okay, let's see what happens. A four. And a white. <laughs> okay, well, I'm thinking gemstones. We have a potential mixed chow. One dot two bam three crack or one dot two crack three bam so we have an option there we could we could pung this is a single limit pung hand we could pung the eight and the seven and then each dragon two paired so these would be the discards I think I would keep the four and the nine in case three, four, five, seven, nine came in for garnet. So I think I would start by discarding those. So this would be jewel. If you would have done something differently, right? Pull three and what you would do with these tiles. If you have tiles at home, Give this exercise a try. Look for a link in the video description below for a set I highly recommend if you don't have one. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next video, may all your picks be keepers.